Hello. Hola. And bonjour, everybody. This is Doug. And Matthew. From McCurl Bros Bodybuilding. MB3. Three. And today, you're going to be watching some clips just of our uh, dumbbell, flat dumbbell press. We decided, well, our, we had a chest day today, and honestly, it's the first chest day we've really had together this whole break, and we haven't even done flat dumbbells since a video, you can check out the link right here, and you can see us doing actually all the way up to 105 for a good set of, you know, six, six or eight or something like that. Uh, today, since we were getting back to dumbbells, we were thinking, ah, oh, we might hit 105 again, but as you'll see in these clips, once we went up to the hundos, we hit 100 pound dumbbells, and they're really, I, this isn't a complete excuse it is, but they're really like crappy, like you'll see it's like they're spaced they're sliding out. sliding around. But still, regardless, we couldn't get very many reps, as you'll see, which all, all I'm saying is we're getting back into it, and that's what happens. Yeah, as you can obviously see by these videos, trying to put the weight back down, we're just not really used to the dumbbells. It's been so long, or maybe our stabilizing muscles have even decreased in strength or whatnot. So basically, we're just getting back into chest, especially using dumbbells. So you can see uh, Doug is really struggling with trying to put the weight down. Oh. I don't know where we are in the video, but you'll see just trying to bring it down just, you know, nicely, but we're not used to all that weight coming down. <laughs> Bops them right in the old rib cage. I know, it's weird because, well, for one, it looks like it, the weight goes down super slow onto my chest, but in real life it felt like it was hitting pretty hard. Like, I normally, I'm used to using rubber dumbbells, and like, I like the y, YMCA, and I can get them up pretty easy, but for some reason this time, every time I tried, it just like came right back down on me. And plus, we had the giggles, so that never helps. I know. Yeah, she couldn't get rid of those things. But yeah, like you said, it's it sounds like a terrible excuse, but honestly, the shape and feel of a dumbbell really, and the balance of it, really challenges you. Like, if it's not perfect, you're always, it's mentally, you're gonna be like, oh, this doesn't feel right. And physically, it could get you off balance and just mess with your head, so it's just tougher to get up. Absolutely, but if a lot of you, if this is making you think that you might not wanna do this because it's so hard, you gotta remember, using dumbbell for flat really hits your inner chest a lot because it helps the contraction when you come up and in, unlike a barbell where you just go straight up and you don't come in. You're actually, with a barbell, you're kinda of pushing up and out, like your hands don't go out, but that's the way your hands are pushing. And that's how your like muscle, I guess, contracts, but with the dumbbell, you'll see when you go up, and obviously you can go in a little bit, and that really adds, uh, we'll get some fibers on the inner chest and really helps us strike. Yeah, you're going to want to see that come dieting time. I hope you guys like this video. Speaking of that, you can go ahead and like the video. Throw down a comment. And even subscribe. Remember, guys, there's always more on the way, so stay tuned.